Let's be honest, by now we've all seen enough realistic robots online to roll our eyes a little, right? Every few months there's a new headline, this robot walks like a human or this robot can dance. But then, Xpeng showed up and suddenly the line between human and machine got really blurry. When Xpeng first rolled out its humanoid robot, called Iron, the internet absolutely lost it. Not because it was clunky or creepy like most prototypes, but because it looked too perfect. Its balance, its stride, even the way it tilted its head, people swore there had to be a person inside. I mean, come on, China unveiling a robot that moves like a living person? The comments went wild. Fake. There's an actor in there. This is CGI. For weeks, that was the narrative, but Xpeng wasn't laughing. Behind the scenes, their engineers had spent years creating this thing. Every tendon, actuator, and artificial muscle, only to be told their work was a hoax. So instead of replying online, they decided to show the truth in the most dramatic way possible. At the next press event, they brought Iron back on stage. The crowd was silent, cameras everywhere. The robot walked out, smooth, balanced with that same human grace that started the controversy. And then, right there under the spotlights, one of the engineers unzipped the synthetic suit. What they revealed was pure metal and circuitry. No actor, no costume, no trickery. Just a mechanical skeleton so advanced it could almost breathe. And then, something incredible happened. The presenter actually apologized to the robot. He said, I'm sorry we had to do this, but we had to prove you're real. You could feel the emotion in the room, because this wasn't just about a robot, it was about trust, identity, and the disbelief that something this good could come from a Chinese company. See, that's the deeper part of this story. If this exact same robot had a Tesla logo on it, or came from Boston Dynamics, people would have accepted it instantly. But Xpeng, the car company from Guangzhou? No way, it had to be fake, that bias hit hard. So Xpeng took it even further. They cut open part of Iron's leg on stage, while it was still powered on, to reveal the internal structure. Synthetic skin peeled back to show fiber-like muscle layers, joint actuators, and precision-engineered servo systems. It was a moment that turned shock into silence, and silence into respect. Now here's where it gets even more fascinating. This wasn't just a PR stunt. Xpeng actually used that moment to launch Iron's next generation, a version so advanced it doesn't just move like a human, it's built like one. This new model has 22 degrees of freedom in its hands, each finger capable of delicate natural motion, a biomimetic spine and muscle system that lets it bend, twist, and balance like a real body and a curved 3D display head that can show facial expressions and interact with humans in real time. It runs on three of Xpeng's own Turing AI chips, delivering an insane 2,250 trillion operations per second. That's not marketing fluff, that's serious brain power. But here's what really surprised everyone. Xpeng's CEO didn't try to overhype it. He said, we're not ready for home robots yet. It's too early, too expensive, too risky. Instead, he explained that these humanoids will start as tour guides, customer assistants, and office concierges inside Xpeng's own buildings. Think about that. While most companies sell concept robots with vague promises, Xpeng is literally deploying theirs to real workplaces first. That's how confident they are in their technology. But the craziest part? That one bold moment, unzipping and exposing the robot on stage, actually changed everything for them. Suppliers who were hesitant before suddenly wanted in, investors started calling, and the narrative flipped overnight. From fake Chinese robot to holy crap, China might actually lead the humanoid race. It's poetic, isn't it? They had to cut open their creation to prove it was real. But in doing so, they exposed something far more important. How quick we are to doubt what's unfamiliar, and how powerful it is when truth speaks louder than bias. Today, Xpeng's iron stands as a symbol of that shift. It's not just a machine, it's proof that innovation doesn't care about borders. It's proof that real progress doesn't need marketing spin. It just needs the courage to show what's under the surface. 
And maybe that's what makes this story so human after all. Xpeng Iron didn't just fool the internet, it reminded us that sometimes the future looks unbelievable until someone dares to open it up and show us it's real.